Hello, Team Libra. It's Empire333 here. I hope you're all well and safe. This is your love tarot reading. I'm going to start out always. I start out with, you know, whatever comes through, whatever energies you're in, okay? And then we'll talk about love, your person, um, whoever's thinking about you, whoever's on your mind, that kind of stuff, okay? And then spiritual advice. So, Spirit, what can you tell for my Libras, what energies they are in? I feel like you're focusing on the future, Libra. You're, like, building a future. I feel like some of you are really focusing on um, financial getting in, like, ringing in. Ringing in, okay, Spirit. Ringing in financial, like, abundance. Some of you are like, I want to make a difference in my family. You know, like, it's kind of like... I want to be different than the way I grew up. So it's it's kind of like maybe you grew up like um, like you didn't feel abundant growing up or you were poor or like you your parents didn't like barely made ends meet. And I'm getting like you want you want to build something. You want to build prosperity for your family or your bloodline is what I'm hearing. OK, so let's see. Spirit, what do you what energies is Libra in? All right. Ooh, I like this. So Libra, you know what it feels like? Okay, there is definitely someone in your life. If they're not here yet, they will come in, okay? So there's definitely a romantic prospect, okay? It's kind of like Libra. You're at this point where you're like, okay, you know what? I want to give love a chance. Um, but for some reason, you know what it feels like? Okay, this is what I want to say. It feels like Libra. Whenever things in love don't go good. Like you could even have just a conversation with someone and you're like, okay, like I'm not really feeling this conversation or like this person's annoying me. It's like that kind of a vibe. <laughs> You quickly change up to like, okay, what am I going to do with my dreams, goals, and ambitions? Let me focus on this. Let me focus on my dreams, which is a good thing, right? Because you're not like sitting there wallowing in like, okay, this is not working now or this person is like, you know, or you're not, you're not entertaining that. And as you do that, as you get like involved in your, you know, dreams, goals, ambitions, whatever it is. It's like you get inspired and your inspiration brings you, um, it brings you fortunate blessings, okay? So some of you are, there's something new, okay, that you're creating at this time. If you haven't had this inspiration yet, you will. The minute you focus on your dreams, goals, and aspirations, I'm getting like, you're like this, you know, obviously you're Libra, you're the scales, right? But I mean, yeah, but I feel like whatever's happening in your love arena right now, Libra, it's supposed to push you towards that. It's supposed to push you towards Yeah, and you might be focusing on your goals, but it's more like it's pushing you forward. It's like reviving your passion for your dreams, okay? So let's get into this person. Who is this person? Um, for those of you who are single, I just want to let you know, if you got nobody, okay, these readings are timeless. So even if you have nobody right now, this could be future person coming in. I want you to know that, okay? Because not every Libra is on the same timeline, okay? There's groups of you are, who are on different timelines. Not all Libras in the world could be on the same timeline. It doesn't matter if you're Libra or whoever, whatever zodiac sign you are, right? And always make sure you check your sun, moon, and rising, okay? Because that will give you a whole picture of everything, all right, spirit, who's in Libra's mind or whose mind is on Libra? Who is this person coming in? Okay. 
Okay. Ooh. Okay. Libra. So there is someone that you could be on a break with. Okay. Like I said, put this at a timeline. If you haven't met this person yet, you will meet them and then you, you both will take a break. Okay. So this is someone, okay, who has a lot of strong feelings for you. Um, but this person doesn't know the right way to approach you yet. So this person is in their feelings. I feel like you both had a falling out. Okay. There's definitely falling out here. Um, some of you think that this person is keeping something from you. Okay. But what they're keeping from you is their true feelings. So now this could be somebody new you just met. It doesn't have to be someone you know for a long time, Libra. Oh. Yeah, somebody's wounded here. So there was something that was said and this person put their walls up. They do want to reach out to you, Libra. But... This is reminding them, I'm hearing, this is reminding them from some type of wound from the past. So it's like you triggered this person. They might have triggered you, Libra. So at this point, this person wants to come towards you. I just heard they care a lot about you, okay? They do. Some of you don't know this person cares about you as much as they do, okay? I don't know um, if it's because this person did not express that to you. But I feel like this person is just taking a time out. And this person doesn't want to... They could be a giver, okay? They are... This person, whoever they are, in nature, they're supportive, right? Right? But I feel like there's something here about balance, okay? And I know you're the sign of balance, but this is about someone like thinking to themselves, okay, uh, I can't give too much right now because, yeah, you open a wound of this person. This person thought that they were over that wound and you opened it up, Libra. Okay, now this could, it doesn't have to be from you. Maybe it, it wasn't you that hurt this person. This could be from the past, okay? Yeah, maybe it was when they were a kid. Oof, the devil. This is something toxic that they went through as a kid, okay? Yeah, it could be family, whatever. Or it could be like they never had that great family life, okay? Maybe they had it at the surface, but it wasn't like that underneath, okay? So maybe it was like... Like things looked good from the outside of their family, but things beneath it was very toxic. I'm getting toxic like patterns very toxic patterns. Okay. So you opened up a wound. So this person, I feel pulled back and they're like, okay, from now on, like, I need to know like what's happening here. You know, they're, so they're working on their wounds, Libra. Okay. Whoever this is. And because this has happened, if this hasn't happened yet, you all, and this comes up, just know that um try to be compassionate about what you're saying libra okay 
but this person is now questioning if they should offer you more, okay, now. Whoever this is, they're, they're questioning that, okay? Um, and they're also questioning how to come towards you. So they, they, they don't want to get hurt again, okay? Whoever this is, they don't want to get hurt again. Um, let me see. Hold on, guys. Wow, I really like this. We got the emperor. Yeah. So this person, okay, if you're getting a cold feeling from this person, it's just because they're trying to process things from the past. But I do see that this person is very attracted to you, Libra. Okay? They think you're amazing. They think that you can make them really happy or happier. Okay, we got the sun card here. So this person truly feels um, like on a soul level that you both, like your souls know each other. Um, and they want to come towards you. I just feel like they miss you, whoever this is. They do miss you. Okay. What does, what's the advice for Libra for this situation? Because yeah, besides, um, just, just like have compassion because some of you, I feel like you don't really know the depths of this person's past. Okay. Okay. Schedule a sacred date with yourself. You deserve time for your life. So Libra, maybe you're supposed to be alone right now. Okay. I know that I know people get triggered when I say that, but okay. Like who wants to be alone? Keep your eyes open. Joy lives in small places. Reflect. So I feel like some of you, um, you're going to be reflecting on things in your life because some of you are, I know this is going to be surprising to some of you because you're a Libra, but sometimes Libra, we're not, we don't speak always with tact, okay, with tact, tact, yeah, and really pay attention to how you said what to this person, okay, and you could, you possibly could not know, maybe this person didn't share that with you, okay, but just think of it like you don't, you don't know everything, okay, retreat, take a mini retreat, Listen to the voice of your soul. So offer your support to someone. Experience the joy of serving others. This is what I feel like. This is this is calling on to you. If you resonate with this person, okay? If this person is like a toxic crap person, okay? This is not your reading, all right? I'm picking up on someone's energy where it's like this is a person who is they can show love. They are very supportive. Um, they uh, they have built a great life for themselves. Okay, this person could have been, like I said, from a uh, a crappy family, and and they have a lot of emotional wounds. But they made so much greatness out of this, right? Out of that the circumstances that they had, right? And so. Now it's like spirit is saying like you could support this person. Some of you are like, uh, uh, I'm not going to fix this person. It's not about fixing. It's about being compassionate about their past. Okay, Libra, that's what I want. I, that's what I'm trying to say. I don't know how, if it's coming out right. So this person does have fears um, of getting hurt. They have fears of being vulnerable. Okay, there are some fears. It's the past. But they, they do want to offer you something, okay? They do want to offer you. They want They want to be with you. Spirit, what else does this person want from Libra? Hmm. This is interesting. Yeah, they want to start new. And this person wants a future with you. Okay, so they're thinking about future. 
future plans. They got their eyes on you, Libra. They want to enjoy stuff, but I feel like this person is questioning you on the deeper level. You know, some things, they want to get to know you better. I feel like this person, and it's because of this, this falling out that you had, okay? Because if someone is questioning the future with you, Libra, like if they're thinking about a future with you and they want to start fresh, and they're like, I want to be free, I want to start a new journey, um... This person really wants to know, like, how you would be in certain situations, okay? Anything else you want us to know about this person? Uh, I was going to say Scorpio. <laughs> what is going on? You know, I've been doing that with all the readings. There's so much different energy in one person, right? Or, like, in people's readings, okay? creativity express your creativity delight in the mystery of your inner muse i feel like this person is like on a whole nother level this person wants to inspire you and they want you to inspire them so it's like such a support it could like the potential of this connection is so balanced and supportive but i feel like you both have to get through those like I said, the emotional wounds, okay? And this is going to require patience, rejuvenation, get a good night's sleep, rejuvenate your body, mind, and spirit. So this person, whoever they are, they've been up at night thinking about you, Libra. Okay? Dreams. Like I said, this person's probably dreaming of you. There are unseen forces ready to support your dreams. This is also Libra about you and your dreams, okay? Like I said from the beginning, your creativity, what you create, what inspires you, what you're passionate about, right? So Libra, just to let you know, this person I feel will make a move towards you. I want you to be ready with compassion and an open mind. Okay, because I feel like this is really good potential. Yeah, they're going to communicate with you. They're going to reach out to you. It might be through a text or whatever, but there is some sort of movement forward. Okay, so don't put this on the back burner because, you know, I don't know. Maybe this person just stopped talking to you and you're mad, Libra. Okay. But this has to do with their emotional wounds, okay? Maybe you were some sort of insensitive. I don't know, okay? Don't come at me. That This is how they feel. Just saying, okay? So I hope that this has helped you. Let me know how you resonate in the comments. And if it, you have been helped, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. I wish you all the best, Libra. And peace out.